Hi folks, Keith from My Point Exactly here. Ever want to draw territories on your Microsoft Streets and Trips map? Here's a quick video to show you how. Let's say I want to mark up the Live Free or Die state, that's New Hampshire, into four distinct regions on my map. To do this, make sure your drawing toolbar is turned on. You can toggle toolbars on and off by right-clicking in the menu bar and checking the boxes next to the toolbar. I'll turn on large buttons to make it easier to see the tools we'll work with. Now, choose a fill color for your first region. Brighter, darker colors will tend to overpower the map, so if you want to see map features within your region, you'll want to choose the lighter fill colors. Next, choose the shape. You may have oval or square regions, but probably not likely. Choose the freeform shape to draw the exact region shape you need. You'll see that your cursor is now a plus sign. Position the cursor over the place where you want to begin and left click to spot your first point. Now you see that wherever you move your cursor, there is a thin black line that is connected back to the point that you clicked on the map. Left click again on another location on the map and a new point is placed with a straight line between this new point and the last point you created. If you hold the left mouse button down and move your mouse, you'll see that the cursor becomes a pencil and you can draw a line freehand on your map. Continue drawing until you've delineated the edges of your territory and are back close to the beginning of your shape. Now double click with your left mouse button and the shape will close up and be filled with the fill color you chose earlier. If you don't like the color after all, just click the shape and choose a different fill color from the fill color bucket. Now chances are you'll want to see the map features in your area, so right click in the shape, choose order, and send behind roads. And that's it! Now create your additional regions and new colors and you've created your territory map. Remember to save your new map. We cover saving the map in Lesson 8 in the free training you'll find at mypointsales.com. Just click Get Free Training to access it. Hey, you know, this training was inspired by Dan D, a My Point Exactly fan who had a question. If you have a question on Microsoft Streets and Trips, drop us a line at learn at mypointsales.com. Maybe we'll make a video out of your question. Thanks for watching. Tell your friends.